Hi everyone, I'm sorry a bit late for this video. I'm making it on the 23rd of December. So it might be a little too late for you to buy these Christmas gifts, but they're open all year round. So today I'm talking about my Christmas my Christmas hauls that I got. I went to various Christmas markets over the past weekend between the 17th and the 19th of December in Port of Spain area. So I went to three. I went to 868 pop-up shop which is held at the one of the magnificent seven houses then i went to the queen's park savannah um christmas uh market and then i also went to armin's art books which is on track Rick world they had their own little pop-up shop so i have brought various different gifts for different people and myself because gotta always spoil yourself and um yeah, so some of you some of you guys will be seeing your presents here. Sorry about that. You might have gotten them already or not. But I just want to wish everyone a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy New Year 2022. I want all the blessings for you. I truly do mean that. So let's start off with this. So I went to 868 Pop-Up Shop and there were um a plant stores and there's a little food section and stuff and in that food section i got this so this is all banana bread various types so i believe one is um this is cookies and cream one is salted caramel and the other one is just regular um regular uh banana bread and it's from the company called banana rama it's homemade coconut bread uh, um the person who makes it on our uh, Instagram. It's called Banana Rama. It tastes really good. She had samples and everything. So there you go. Gonna flip it. So if you like like food or you know some foodies at home or anything like that, and you like, hey, you want something? Try Banana Rama. Next on the food item, it's a local wine business. Oh, see, Merry Christmas. This is the, the packages. It's called Chauzette. Chauzette? Chauzette, I want to say. I'm not French, but I'm going to spell it out for you. C H A U S H E and T T, Trinidad and Tobago. And they make various um, local homemade wines. Uh, when I went to the store in 868 Pop Up Shop, um, most of the wines were sold out. And they had a little bundle. Um, uh, five bottles for one hundred and fifty dollars. These are the size of the bottle. Five bottles for one hundred and fifty. No, one hundred and twenty. I'm sorry. Oh, one hundred and twenty. And this is it. One of the bottles, and it's sorrow wine. So I bought three sorrow wines, and the other fl um, flavor that I got was passion fruit. They're really good. They're all online on Instagram and Facebook. So again, Shoshi, and their Instagram is Shoshi Shoshi TT. So, but away. So, whoever gets that, you get some really delicious stuff. So, um, when I went to the pop up shop, pop up shop at Armin's um, Artworks, and they had some various like lot of paintings, designers, and stuff. So, one of the artists was selling some bookmarks and her name is Jo Mercedes um, that's the, that's what she goes by artistically but her name is Josanne Young Singh and she makes these little booklets and so cute so this is her this is Jo I'm gonna flip it so she does cards as well Christmas cards she does little paintings for a budget she wasn't really that expensive actually so um, one of the cards because it is a present. It says, happiness can be found. Right? Really great. And there's the other one. I can't go it. But try it out. All local businesses I'm showing in this Christmas haul are all local businesses. The next one that I did was a Christmas card, a local bit, by the name of Anushi, Anushi Artworks. Um, this is Anushi Das. And she makes this little card. She also does paintings. This is her little business card. It's well. There you go. Oh, sorry. And it's really nice. It's a good little card. She does paintings as well. 
So. Love is getting us to be happy. Getting that. Christmas. While I'm at the art section of my Christmas haul, I'm going to just take out my paintings right now. So, I'm going to show you one of my paintings. It's from Sammy Jo. And this is her details here. Sammy Jo Art Studios. She's really good. She's really friendly and stuff. There. Um, her muse of art is like, bottles anything around so i love hummingbirds i love hibiscus flowers and i love outdoors so for her artwork i saw these two little nice hummingbird paintings that she did on newspapers that was her medium for these two so that was in the box that it came in and these two cute hummingbird set they're so cute and they come with their own little easels you know she really told of this so yeah, it's so cute. So cute. So Sammy Joe's Art Studios, guys. I'm gonna show her things again. Yeah, check it out. My next present, the presents that I got, was three paintings from one artist. So I'm gonna show you the artist's um, details. So hold on for a second. This is her. So it's by by Jill. That's who she goes by, and she's a really nice woman because she's not cool. She's a woman. Uh, like a three, she had a book of her different prints, and I was like, I went through a book, and it was really nice. Um, so each print was a hundred, and she, you could get them framed. It was for one fifty. Again, this was at the Armin's um, bookshop. So this is the first printing that I got. By by J by JL. So really crazy, really beautiful. This is the next one I got. So yeah, Black Panther Surrey. The last one I got from her this one again hummingbirds you know I guess like hummingbirds there it is and I love that the color each um, the ma the major color came out in the frame so I really like that so yeah so by Jaya so I'm gonna put up her art her details her flyer she does she could you could also do portraits with her and anything she's like I do everything so I'm like okay girl so there you go. So that was the art section of gifts for my Christmas haul that I went. Put this away. As you guys hear. Oh, okay. So next part, I'm gonna do hair care. So at the Queens Park, um, Savannah Christmas Market that was last weekend. I don't know if they're here during the week, but I went to the store and they had this. So it's from KS Cosmetics and there's a um, underlined from between the word cause and metics. So this is a Chibi um, Fuse Hair Cream. Really nice. It smells really nice too. They also had um, hair oil. No, this is the body oil. So it's the body oil. I think this is the hibiscus body oil. A little hibiscus there. Again, I'm all of these products are locally made, Trinidad and Tobago, because I'm really about supporting local businesses. And then they had the Chibi infused hair oil. It's really good. Break contacts. I'm gonna show you how God. Ooh, sorry. I'm gonna break things. Ah. So how bad is this? Thanks for your support. And see KS Cosmetics on Instagram and Facebook. And okay, in this hair care is another hair care product that I got. I think yes, this is from the 868 pop-up shop that I went to. 
Um, I have their contact details here. Um, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But it's almost edible. It's a hair, body, and bath oil. And they're from Tobago. And I saw it's like the only Tobago store. And they also were selling like um, old time swizzle sticks and old time strainers and, and dashboards and stuff. So that's really nice. And they actually, the the lady who was selling at the store, she had this awesome like jewelry, like statement piece necklace and earrings to match and she said oh yeah i got this from a tobago woman and the, t the the tobago designer who makes all her jewelry was la roche designs and up in i believe space side she believed so somewhere in the countryside in tobago so that was an additional plug i didn't i got this but you know i saw that statement piece i'm like i'm gonna try that lady for the for the uh, necklace so this is their this is who they are. This um rub is it rub down? Rub that down. So they also do um seasonings and stuff for food and meats. Rub that flavors, that's the name of the um company. Rub that flavors, they're also on Instagram. And the necklace that she recommended the designer, another local designer, is called La Roche Designs, another Tobacco. So yeah. So that's and funny. Next was at the 868 pop up shop. There was a company that's called My Grandma's Soapery. Um, a couple, a husband and wife, I believe, and also a daughter. And I bought a passion fruit candle, one wick. They also sell three wicks. They also do lotions, soaps, and oils. So, yeah. That's called my grandma's soapery. There you are. It's one wick. There it is inside. There. Right? Local business on Instagram. And at the 868, there's a lady who sells uh, herbal rem remedies. And it was called Ma Melody. And Melody is spelled M E L L O D E E. Melody. Um, and it's a tea. She said it could be hot tea, cold tea. You could make it as a juice. You could take it like separate in time. So this is a tropical style tea. Be nice. So check her out at Ma Melody Herbal Blends. That's her numbers there. You can add zoom in there and her email address. There we go. Next on the agenda is hair accessories. So, at the 868 booth, there was Afro accessories. So, if you know, if you on Instagram a lot or you, you know follow some Trinidad and Tobago influencers, you see a lot of them, um, black ones, <laughs> Afro accessories. So, she does hair, um, head ties, turbans, necklaces, bracelets, book covers, whatever you could do it afro prints or african prints um wax prints to be specific um she has that she uses that as a medium of art and what i got there was some turbans so african print turban the knots really pretty i love it then i got a simple Turban again, these are some of these are gifts, love me, <laughs> and this is her signature knot. Really nice. And one more, a normal turban. And as appreciation, I got this little um, body bottle. I've actually bought I, it's on my Instagram. Um, from this company, De Jeunesse, I believe. So it's up there. Um, I got a lavender body butter from them that sells at Massey Store Marvel. I'm sure there's other Massey stores. And it was so good. It smells so good. It's like smooth on your body and everything. So this was a little gift from Afro Accessories with the body butter. So I appreciate that. At the... 
um, Queen's Park Savannah Christmas Market. There was a little store, a little girl, young woman, I think between 20, um, more at most less than 25. And she was selling these handmade um, head ties, these bands, these um, little um, bracelets and stuff, cloth bracelets. And I saw this Chanel, and if you know me, I love Chanel. Chanel is one of my luxury fashion bands that I love because I, I like the story behind the founder, Coco Chanel. I really love it. So I was like, oh, I'm going to support her. And I have the details, I'll put this away, sorry, of the young woman. So hold on, I'm not going to get it for you. Oh no, there it is. She in style. So her and her friend had the little store there, and I was like, I'm going to support her. So it's really nice. Really nice. So now on to the jewelry. You guys, jewelry. I'm a jewelry freak. I'm a jewelry freak. A jewelry freak. A little jewelry. <laughs> Um, so here's my bag. So the first one I got was these little earrings that the, at the end of them is for resin. It's from this lady. I got saw their little stall at the um, almonds at Wilkes. This is her details. Now I'm gonna flip all these. So whoever has these, it's upside down. I'm sorry. Really nice. I love the little design. I love the earthy still with the tones and everything. And came in this little bag. So it's really nice. I really appreciate that. Next in the bag. So I went to a pop up store at uh, Shades um, Stages, uh, which is on Arapita Avenue. So upstairs above the restaurant, there's like some little creative space. And these little creators came together called The Hive and had these little pop-up store. So it's from Trademark Sun Design. So I bought these earrings and I love the I love her business card because she uses her cloth. And these earrings, isn't they cute? It reminds me of Avatar, the fire sign, fire nation. So whoever likes Avatar, you know, especially <laughs> Prince Zuko. Yeah, this is for you. Again, it's trade. Oh, trademark designs. I'm sorry if I. I think I said trade by design, but trademarks design. She also does jewelry. She does clothes, and she has these cloth bracelets and necklaces as well. So next one. So this is from the Topaz True, and it's a bracelet. I know it's a bracelet. So you can follow. This is her Instagram. Hope you guys could see that clearly. This bracelet is a lovely bracelet. In the box, there it is. It's a bracelet. That cute. She made this herself. She makes bracelets. I believe earrings and rings. When I saw her boot, I saw the boots. Her boots at um, Armand's um, Artworks on Chapric Road. So yeah, it's all about us. Oh, yeah. All local businesses, guys. All found in Trinidad and Tobago. I love that. Yeah. The two pastures. So at the stages pop up shop, um, my cousin wanted me to go to this particular booth. It's called Golden Era by a young woman, I believe in her 20s. And it's set, the aesthetic is late 80s, 90s. And she was selling gold chains. She also does um, beanies, um, sweatpants, crop tops, and stuff. So um, this one is a chain as well. So I'm trying to. There's another chain, so I'm going to show you the other chain. So there's a chain. 
And again, Golden Arrow. That's the name of the business. This is really good. So support everybody's on Instagram and stuff. Try that out. Next on the agenda is a little bracelet. So I saw this at I did not get the guy's detail and I'm very sorry. Um whoever like if you probably could call um Armin's art shop and find out who was at their pop up market, Christmas market, and find out who this guy is, but he's a really nice gentleman. He got these little bracelets, he was also doing necklaces and he also had this really lovely big hummingbird painting and I was like, I wish I could I wish I could afford that painting. But I couldn't <laughs> Um, but I got this bracelet instead. So whoever's like very earthy again, I was just like I have a lot of earthy people like who like neutral colors, you know, very natural into their jewelry. So whoever's got that, get that. Next is from a, a local company called Oak Bay. So O G B with the O J B E with the accent over the B. Um, they were also at the store at KS Cosmetics, um, so they shared a booth, and it's this really lovely bracelet with the Chinese dragon, I believe, on it. Oh my god, it matches my uh, <laughs> clothes. <laughs> um, so yeah, so OGB, OGB, OGBE, accent of the B, um, came in this little bag. And all look business. I found this at the Queen's Park Savannah Christmas Market. And finally, I believe it's finally. Yes, finally. Um, I saw this booth at the 868 Pop Up Shop. It's from Earth Links. So Earth Links, not with a y, I, but with a Y. So Earth. L Y N K S, a local business in Trinidad and Tobago. Um, really lovely lady, and she was selling these bracelets. It's all about um, chakra linings and energies. So, this is one of them. Um, this is um, her, from her male line for men. She specifically said that's from a guy, so maybe it's whoever's getting this. And. This is the other one. So pretty. So there you go. So from this from Earthlinks. Uh, Instagram. And finally I got these little earrings from the Queen's Park Savannah um, Christmas Market from an, a little stall. Didn't have any cards or details. So I couldn't get that and do apologize. And uh, this is it. The little earrings. Evil eye. Really pretty. It was not it was not you know, it wasn't that expensive. It really wasn't. It was less I think she sold it for me for forty dollars or sixty dollars. So yeah. So that's it for my Christmas haul. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm gonna make some mentions for like other people I didn't buy from them, but I was really impressed by them, so I'm gonna just list them out. So there's there was a CMOS um, uh, drink or a creator by called by Gia Energy. So Gia as in like Mother Gia, Mother Earth, but she spells it as G A E A Energy T T. And she was selling sea moss mixed with passion fruit, with turmeric, with ginger. And she had these samples and you could taste them. It was delicious. She also had teas with the sea moss uh, mixed with it as well. I also told you about rub that, fl rub that flavors without the U. La Roche Design, Tobago brand. Rub, rub that flavors is also Tobago brand. Theophilus Home, they did knitting. They do a lot of knitting a meal. Um, I store this at the stages um, pop up shop. Um, they had this lovely like knitted uh, belt, 
brown that was beautiful um next is chef sabrina or sabrina exotic chockney um i got there at the 868 868 pop-up uh, market she was had chicken chicken um pilori and shrimp pilori with various um chockneys uh i really did enjoy that it was really nice and then at the queen's park savannah um christmas market i saw this store i like it attracted me because it's like it's jewelry i was like i'm a jewelry fanatic and it's called ivy and iona and these two lovely ladies and my god the jewelry was ex like exquisite and i'm like ah, i wish i could buy it and it's very vintage very vintage i, I love it so check out the instagram ivy and iona iona guys guys i'm telling you we have lots of creativity here at the 868 um pop-up shop there was the crochet by Michaela. she does another set of crochets there's a card threads by tix and there was this other stall and they were selling ceramic um, earrings and, um, and not bracelets, but definitely the earrings, ceramic earrings. And it, it was like featuring these kind of like color patterns and stuff. So they're really good. And there was this store that was selling um, photograph prints, but she wasn't there. I think I, can't, I went too early. So I got to find out who that was. But there was this picture that she took at the night sky in the jungle, in the forest, on the northern range. Beautiful, magnificent. So if anybody knows who had the first stall at Almond's um, Artworks, with the, was selling photographs, please hit me up and let me know. But that's my Christmas haul, my mentions. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you support local businesses not only through Christmas but throughout the year, um, the whole year. Their, their market stalls throughout the country, throughout Trinidad and Tobago. We have a lot of creative people in everything. Every, everything that you could think of, we have it here. And we really need to support them. And I know it's nice to like go outside and buy things and like there, but. Come on, let's be realistic. Right now, we're having like a custom delay for everything. Prices are skyrocketing, skyrocketing in, in customs, like crazy exorbitant prices. And, you know, it's really nice to see, like during this COVID time, that see people who never thought of being entrepreneurs or opening up their little business and they, they're doing it. And it's really great to support them. It really is. So wherever you are whatever country you are you're watching this whatever nation please support your local business they really need you and that's how your country rises and that's how you're econ economically you rise all right guys so i hope you enjoy that i hope you enjoy my video i know it might be a little too long but i appreciate it and if you want more let me know let me know bye for now bye love you